steps away from one of Edmonton's most vibrant neighborhoods. I know I do. Welcome back to another video. Today, we're sharing a very special project, specifically Ascension Block Townhomes by Kintero. Today, we'll be showing you the show home. The 1,632 square foot home features three beds and two and a half baths, and it's absolutely gorgeous inside. And like I said, we're steps away from some of Edmonton's best cafes and restaurants, located right in the center of Edmonton near downtown, as well as the River Valley. So let's go take a look inside and please let us know what you think. For more information about Kintero, see the links below. And as always, like, subscribe, and share this video to see some more. Let's go. So welcome inside this beautiful home. Right off your entry on your ground floor is a nice little office nook, perfect if you work from home and you have a few clients, keeping it separate from the rest of your home. And we also have a closet space, actually two, because there's one right next to the front entrance, and a two-car garage. So what's perfect about this ground floor is not only is it separated from the rest of your house, it keeps the entrances separated from the rest of your house. No more of that clutter as you come in and out, plus plenty of light. In addition to a small seating area just off the front on the ground floor of the house. So let's take you up to the main floor. Welcome to your main floor. This beautiful main floor features onyx interiors, which is an interior design style by Kintero, where you'll see plenty of dark accents throughout the home, tiling, cabinets, etc. So when you come to see one of these townhomes or to buy one of these townhomes, you'll have the choice between onyx or opal, which opal is the lighter version. So lighter cabinets, lighter tiles. And you'll see why that's important in a few minutes in addition to the kitchen. So let's show you around this beautiful kitchen. This luxurious kitchen comes with a gas stove range, including a built-in grill pan, which if you like pancakes like me is perfect, but yeah, <laughs> watch your hands there. But one of the things that caught my eye immediately was the built-in fan. So seamlessly goes in through the interior with your cabinetry. So it keeps that elegant and luxurious look in addition to these open shelves, which is kind of a cool feel. You have plenty of storage space between inbuilt pantries, as well as cabinetry, plus the floor to ceiling windows. You cannot get better natural light than this. Perfect amount of fridge space here. Your microwave and dishwasher are built into your kitchen island, which also features a bit of an upgraded sink with that beautiful black sink. Again, moving seamlessly into that theme. So you can fit three to four people sitting here. So you have a really good use of space, but also an entertainment space in your home or for your kids. But Moving forward into here, your, one of your true entertainment spaces in the house, your dining room. Beautiful featured lighting, plenty of space for six or more people, and just a nice little dinner party spot between two very, very open areas with those floor to ceiling windows. Now hidden back in this hallway here, kind of unnoticeable to the eye, is a pantry space. So a little bit of shelving kept away from anyone you have over, as well as your first of your two and a half bathroom. Now, what I would say is probably one of the biggest showstoppers of the house, and it's not this beautiful staircase right behind me, is the living area. Thank you. 
This spacious living area is unlike any I've seen in any townhomes thus far. This is where the Onyx versus Opal comes in. Light versus dark tiling, which I'm sure will look beautiful in both settings, but talk about a statement piece in their house. Can you imagine just having people over and them seeing this beautiful fireplace for the first time? This is one of your many talking pieces. Now, while I can sit in this beautiful area forever, and honestly, I, I would be tempted to, moving forward to your second outdoor space, but stopping a little bit before is your bar area. Perfect for a coffee bar, juice bar, or an alcohol bar, whatever suits your needs. And then going outside, it's a really nice day today, is your biggest seating space. So this beautiful outdoor space features the grown and developed trees in this gorgeous neighborhood. As well as even though we're in central downtown, you don't hear much. It's so quiet and serene here. Birds chirping from the nearby ravine sun shining can you find a better place to have your morning coffee i don't think so so let's head back inside and we're going to take you up to the bedroom space on the second floor and not to tease you but another little showstopper is seen but can i just give a moment to say i absolutely love these staircases because it brings that light and openness up throughout the house so before we show you the primary bedroom over here, hint number one, what is the showstopper? Let's show you the two other bedrooms on this tour. Very well spaced and thought out. These bedrooms can be guest bedrooms, kids bedrooms, or even a yoga studio as you see here. And they have these beautiful big windows bringing lots of light and airiness into this home. So, little stop by before the second bedroom, stackable washer dryer unit. Very convenient that it's up on your second floor. And your last guest bedroom. Plenty of storage space in those closets. And again, Lots of natural light. Not that you can really tell, but the curtains are actually closed in this shot, but there's still so much light peering through. Now this was a shocker to me and to Varun, to be honest. This beautiful guest bathroom, and as you might've seen in the kitchen, has under cabinet lighting, but also some of the most incredible counter space. Like, when have you seen this much counter space in many guest bathrooms or kids' bathrooms? So there's no excuse. There's so much storage that it can all be hidden or put in a place. Now, stopping at the linen closet, of course, have to show you the incredible use of storage. Here's my second favorite place in the house. I'll give you a few guesses why, of course but this is the primary bedroom. One thing you will notice first, of course, is this amazing window. Here's the shot for height perspective. But also just how high these ceilings are, it just makes this so much more relaxing and a place where you can truly unwind at the end of the day. Plus, the benefit of having this as your ensuite is pretty enticing, if you ask me. Beautiful floor to ceiling tiles, a luxurious shower with inbuilt shelving, under cabinet lighting, two sinks, and natural light peering through. Just to assure you, privacy screens. So you don't have to worry about that too much. But as Varun shows you the walk-in closet, of course, we have to show you that. That will conclude not only the tour of my favorite area of the house, 
except that living room, which I'm a little bit biased to, but also this beautiful, luxurious townhome featured by Kintero. If you're interested in Ascension Block, visit ascensionblock.ca, link down below in our description, or visit Kintero's website. And of course, for more information about homes, feel free to reach out to us in our comments, like and share our videos, and we can't wait to continue to bring you more house tours. Thank you for your support thus far. Bye.